In this video, I'm going to show you how to do a packet capture. In this case, uh, the computer I'm using is a remote desktop uh, computer, and it's up here in the upper left. And then this is my local computer here where I'm going to actually um, send some packets to this computer to make sure I capture them and see them. All right, first thing we do is download Wireshark, and it's at wireshark.org. And I click download here. And I choose the 64-bit because this is 64-bit Windows that I'm installing it on. And I've already done that, so um, I launched it here. And it starts up, and there's no interfaces selected. This is version 2, a little different interface than previous versions. And what I'm going to do is uh, select the adapter. It's uh, here on the uh, toolbar and a black dot. And I click on that. And then I select the uh, Ethernet card. If you have multiple cards here, you would select that. And then down here in the Capture Filter, I'm going to type uh, port 4739. That happens to be the port I want to capture. Now, normally you would capture everything and just filter out what you see. But in this case, I only want to capture this port, uh, both TCP and UDP. Then I click Start, and it starts capturing. There's no packets on that uh, port yet. So it's empty, and this is a live capture. It shows here live capture in progress. So over here on my local computer, I'm going to use a free Microsoft uh, utility called Port Query, and I'm going to specify a protocol of UDP and the endpoint port of 4739 and the destination node, N for node, and the IP address. And this dash NR is optional here. It just means don't bother resolving this IP address to a name. And the easy way for, that I remember this is uh, it, the parameters is dash P E N or pen for short, like a pen that you write with. And then just NR is optional. OK, so now I'm going to send just this uh, one packet here uh, to that target machine. And it says it's listening, uh, which is what I'm really testing. And you can see that the source IP address is my local computer. The destination is this uh, server over here on the left. And the protocol is UDP. The length of the packet is 63 bytes. And it uh, tells you, I'm not sure what this other info is. But you look at the time column here. And it uh, took almost zero seconds, or effectively zero seconds. So I'm going to do it again. If I press the up arrow, get that same command back. and it shows again. OK, now I'm going to uh, do this same command, but I'm going to change the port number just to show you what doesn't work. I'm going to change it to 38. And it immediately says not listening here on this end on my local computer end. So uh, you know nothing shows up as you would expect over here. That's it. Thanks for watching.